Hey, what's up everyone? This is OK Chief, and I got some more mail. Now this special package comes all the way from England. It's open because um, I had to check for a certain item in here that didn't spoil. Um, that was through the request of the sender, which is my really awesome good friend Michael Cook. Or if he's better known as Toasted the Undead on Twitter. And uh, the Nintendo Freaks on YouTube. So that's really awesome. This came all the way from a small isle, island. I get rocks. I'm, I don't even want to butcher this. It's, it's rocks. L Isle of White. God, I hope I said that right, brother. But I just wanted to give his little island a shout out. This comes from really far away. Took a quite a while to get to me. And a cool note. This is the box I sent him. He's like my pin pal, like my UK pin pal. I sent him a box of stuff, and he sends me a box of stuff. And uh, some of the games in here that are in here uh, were purchased by me. If you guys remember a while back ago, he did a video for me where he went to one of his old retro shops, and uh, he he picked out these games. Well, I he skyped with me. And I picked out those games, and those games are in here. But he also added some bonus stuff, which were some candies. So without further ado, and by the way, uh, Customs tore the shit out of this box. It practically came like this. So um, I went over everything that came that came in this box um, with Michael to see if everything came and everything was here. And uh, like I said, it, it barely made it. It barely made it. So without further ado, let's just jump right into this box of goodies. I've been getting a lot of overseas packages with like candies and stuff and that's been so awesome. This is no different. I'm super excited. I'm super excited to try some of these new candies. And from what I see, um, there are a lot of sweets in here that are to my fancy. So let's just dive right in, guys. So right off the bat, we see an awesome looking squishy gummy. They're called the Refreshers and they're called Squashies. Check that out. This looks so cool and delicious. I can't wait to try some of these. I'll try some of them. I won't try all of them because there's a whole box of goodies here and I just, I, I'm not just, I'm not gonna eat them all at once. So we've got something called Chew It's Extreme. Six extreme sour apple candies. That looks delicious. I love uh, hard candies like this. I love sucking on uh, candies, no pun intended. Uh, ooh, we have here, what is this? Freddo. It's some kind of uh, Cadbury. Ooh, Cadbury. Cadbury's really good. I love Cadbury. Cadbury's a really good uh, milk chocolate. They, 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 Cadbury knows how to make chocolate. I love Cadbury products. We have here, what is this? Milky Bar. This looks to be some type of white chocolate. Some little cowboy there. I'm gonna have to try that. That's by Nestle. That looks interesting. Mm -hmm. We've just got a whole box. There's. I'm gonna leave the last goodie candies till the end because he was really excited to uh, see that. Uh, we have, to, or to see me see that. We have something here called Wham, the original classic recipe. And it's suitable for vegetarians, as it says so right there. I don't know what this is. It's really hard. It feels like taffy almost. Like really hard. I don't know what that is. So I'm going to have to check that out, see what that is. We have a long, it's called Chalk Mint Flavor Rock. So it looks like a mint, like a candy cane that's chocolate mint flavored. Oh, I can see the chocolate and the mint. So that's really cool. This is supposed to be a, this looks like, it would taste like Andes. You guys know about Andes, right? I love Andes. And this looks like there's a picture of that shit right there on the cover. So we have that there. Moving on, we have something called Sherbert Fountain. Natural colors and flavors. What is this? Made in Britain, Candyland. 
check that out, guys. I don't know what that is. I haven't the slightest clue. Twist to open. It looks like some type of toothpaste. I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm really curious. We have a huge mega double lollies. That's what they're called, mega double lollies. Boom, boom. Love it. Look at this. This is gonna take me a week to finish. Awesome. Here we have strawberry push pops, and it has the minions on there. Oh, I love minions. That looks like a push pop that we have here in the States. I know exactly what that is. We have strawberry flavored chewits. So these look to be like, uh, kind of like, uh, like noun laters that we have here, I think. I don't know until I try them. No hydrogenated fats. www.chewits.co.uk. So that's a UK product right there, guys. We have all oh, some of my most delicious favorites. Type of candies, type of candies. Harbro, little jelly men, and the little jelly bean or jelly um what do you call these? Gummy bears, I'm sorry, gummy bears, brain farts. And they say 50 pence. If, I, am I, if I'm corrected, I'm sorry. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. Please correct me. But I think that means 50 pence. The 50p? Not 50 pints, 50 pence. I hope I said that right. We also have here from Refreshers and Candyland, it looks to be some type of lifesavers. I don't know. We're going to have to try some. I don't know what that is. We have Dip Dab. This looks really familiar. Dib a dab. It, it feels like powder. And it feels like there's a stick in there. Oh, there's a lollipop. There's a lollipop in there, and you just constantly dab. You dab the lollipop into the powder. Man, this is some sugary stuff you sent me here, brother. We also have. Oh, they got bazooka out there! Sweet! Look at that. Original bazooka. And uh, we also have bazooka gums. Bazooka, when I was a kid, used to come with little comic strips wrapped around the pink gum, which was really cool. And uh, here we have the final candy piece. And he was really excited about these because he also collects these. These are Kinder Surprises, Kinder Eggs, as he called them. And um, I got one in the, actually one came in, and when I opened it up, this is what was shaking around. It was all loose. And I, I remember I took a picture of it, how it came. I think Customs opened it. And uh, this is all that was left of the egg. I ate the chocolate. It was really good. And uh, these are the Kinder Eggs. These come inside the eggs. They're like this. See, they look like this. And it says Kinder Surprise. So what? It's a it's a candy shell of of Kinder chocolate. I don't know if you know Kinder, but Kinder's supposed to be really, really, really good chocolate. Что такое любовь? Ну это когда ты улыбаешься, ждешь, а потом бежишь изо всех сил и радуешься встрече, когда ты знаешь, о чем мечтает мама, а мама знает, о чем мечтаешь ты. Киндер шоколад – это нежный молочный шоколад. Он такой вкусный и так нравится детям. Киндер шоколад – лучший способ передать любовь. And um, they wrap the egg, the chocolate egg, around this thing, and and there's supposed to be these toys that are back there. There's supposed to be those toys back there, and uh, you're supposed to get at least one of them. You're supposed to get an Avengers. So two out of three or one out of three, you're supposed to get an Avengers. So in order for me to do that, I have to crack open these eggs. And I'm going to do that, but just not right now. Okay, we have some. What are these? The travel brochures. This one's from, it says, Vent, the official visitor guide, Vent, Vent, Ventnor, UK. I don't know where that is. <laughs> I'm guessing this is where he's from. Isle of Wight. If White. I hope I said that right. This is where he's from, guys. 
He's from very, very far away, and he's my awesome friend. So I made a friend through, that's why I love YouTube, because I made a friend that lives thousands of miles from me. I've never met him, but we're really good friends over media. And I've considered him one of my really good friends. Michael, you're one of my really good friends. Oh, and your girlfriend, Chole. Shout out to Chole. She's awesome too. Uh, Isle of Wight, another eating out guide. So this is where you, if you're ever in Isle of Wight, this is a perfect guide to find where all the, the restaurants are and all the pubs. So this is really cool. Oh, this is awesome. What is this? Parallel Lines Blondie. Is this a CD? I'm thinking, oh, it's a CD, Blondie. I've heard of Blondie. I'm in the bumble that you want across the hall. I don't know their top of their 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 hit. This is probably going to be. I'm going to have to listen to this. This is a CD from them. A lot of good hits there. Hanging on the telephone, one way or another. Picture this. Fade away. Pretty baby. I know, but I don't know. Will anything happen? Sunday girl. Heart of glass. I'm going to love you too. Just go away. So that's Blondie. I remember Blondie. Don't get me wrong. I do remember Blondie. What the heck is this? Resident Evil Code Veronica from Dreamcast, but I think this is a promo. Yes, it's a volume 10 promo disc from Dreamcast. If you remember, Dreamcast came out with a ton of these promo discs to promote their games, and uh, I, I have a ton of those Dreamcast ones. Oh, I remember this. He forgot to mention to put this in a nut the, the previous UK package. Which, by the way, you will be able to see down up here in the corner. Uh, you'll be able to check out all the other packages that Michael Cook himself sent me. So, and uh, one of those packages, he sent a whole bunch of these cards. And he forgot to send this Echo the Dolphin card. And now it's complete. So he sent that. We have a 14-day trial Xbox Live Gold trial for Tomb Raider. And uh, there's a code in the back anybody needs that by all means I don't know if this works or not so don't if it works it works if you grabbed it whoever grabbed that first awesome if not I'm sorry and now we're down to the games guys holy shit I bought these games and some games he sent here so let's get to the games he sent me we oh space harrier this is the Japanese version of space harrier on the game gear I don't have that one for the collection. We also have your Wonder Boy for the Game Gear. Nice. This is the this is a PAL game, and uh, I'm pretty sure that uh, the Game Gear is region locked. Oh, re yeah, region locked. No, unlocked. I'm pretty sure I can play those. Oh, sweet! He sent this. He sent me a Wonder Swan. If you don't know what Wonder Swans are, they're the last handheld that Gunpei. Uh, himself made and uh, Gungpei was actually Yokoi, Gungpei Yokoi he uh, made, he was the inventor of Game Boy Game & Watches, all that, he made that shit he left Nintendo to go make, to form his own company after Virtual Boy flopped and uh, he was disgraced and he went and go started his own company and Wonder Swan was the next console he invented, handheld console he invented before he died and these were the games, he sent me a couple of these games and this is the box that he sent the game to. So now I have the box to complete that game. And here is, oh, here's the other box that he sent. He sent this game, but now he sent the box, sweet. So now they're complete because the games have just been loosely with the console. Now I have the boxes that go with the game, which is sweet. Thank you so much, Michael. Now let's get to the creme de la creme of what he did send. I mean, don't get me wrong, all this other stuff was amazing, it was great. But here's the stuff that I've been really looking forward to playing. Wow, right off the bat. These are all going to be PAL games that I don't have for the system. Here we have Sega Master System, The Simpsons, Bart vs. Space Mutants. Oh, how cool is this, to play this on the Sega Master System. I cannot wait to play this. And I only got this for 8 I think it's British pounds, I'm not sure, or euros, I'm not sure, I don't remember, I think they're euros, I'm not sure, I don't even know how much that is, guys. So we have here, 
Marble Madness. I've got this for the Nintendo. I love it on the Nintendo. I've got this for the Sega Genesis. And now I have it for the Sega Master System. I'm super happy to have this great game. I freaking love this game. And now I have it for the system that I love so much. There's one game in here in particular that I'm going to save to the end. We have the Lion King, guys. For the Sega Master System. Pal, there's 10 levels to this game. I'm dying to see I'm dying to see what type of gameplay this is this looks amazing I love that cover art that cover art looks so sweet I love it and here finally we get down to what I've really 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 wanted in my collection I've, I've sought this after so much and finally I've been able I was able to get it for a good price Ninja Gaiden for the Sega Master System. You've only seen this, a lot of you've only seen this for the, for the Nintendo, but it actually came out in PAL version for the Sega Master System. Doesn't play like anything like the Nintendo version, so don't think that for one second. This plays just like a Sega Master System game, and uh, this is quite pricey, guys, and I got it sent all the way from, from the UK, so I feel very special to have a friend like Michael Cook you rock, brother. Thank you so much for being so awesome. I love the packages you sent. You are just an amazing person. Thank you so much. And I uh, hope to do some more packages with you the way we did them with Skype. That was a lot of fun. So, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to check out Michael's link to his YouTube channel. Completely forgot about that. I'm so sorry. Um, Michael, check him out. The Nintendo Freaks. I'll have a link down to his YouTube channel down below. I love that guy. Get to know Michael. Michael's a really cool guy. He's from the UK, like I said before. All this amazing stuff came in that small package. I love it. I love it. I love it. So, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Until the next one, guys, this is OK Chief. Peace out, y'all.